Hey everybody, it is Tony here, and you have found Makeup and Margs. Um, I decided to start this channel because I love makeup and I love margaritas, so I thought, you know what, why not combine the two? Uh, my main makeup that I will be showcasing here is Saint. I am a Saint Beauty artist, just recently became one, and the reason I became one is because I absolutely adore this makeup. But I thought some of the first few videos that I would do would just be to show you my saint stash, my saint hauls, whatever you would like to call them. So what I'm going to do today is show you like the first products I ever got from saints. So obviously some of these hauls will be used product because I've been using them and I didn't think to do like an unboxing video. I will unbox an artist kit later though. So if you're thinking about becoming an artist, you might want to watch that one when it comes up in the next few days. So this is, I went to a party back in June and tried saying, I had heard lots about it, but I wanted to see it in person. So once I finally saw it in person, I was like, I have got to use this stuff because it's amazing. Just the feel of it. It feels like I have nothing on. It's just a very natural uh, feeling and a natural glow. You can obviously make it, you know, more coverage, lighter coverage. I prefer a very light coverage. And then I like to play with the lip and cheek colors mostly. Sometimes I'll do eyeshadow, sometimes not. Anyways, so I just started off pretty simply. I did three eyeshadows, my main highlight, my brightening highlight, and my contour. For those of you don't, who don't know what Saint is, it's like a 3D makeup. So you can use one to two highlight colors and your contour. I mean, more or less if you want, but um, it, it's super easy. You literally just place your makeup and blend it so there's not really any thinking involved. So, like I said, I got my two highlights, my contour. I got three regular size lip and cheek and then two, three of the holiday lip and cheek, which are the smaller versions. I did three illuminators. I did the vanilla dust setting powder and then three eyeshadows. So, I'm going to show you all the different products. Oh, and I also did a palette. So, this is what I love about Saint. You can literally have all of your makeup in one thing. Now, this palette isn't going to have very much in it because I took most everything out to show you in this video, but I got the 18, the 18 palette, which means it holds 18 of the tins that are this size, the rectangle tins, or it'll hold double that of these little square ones, um, like the eyeshadow and the holiday lip and cheek. So here's what it is. In one of these um, palettes, you have the 18 anyways, you have two levels. So you can fit, like I said, nine of these in your palette or um, in each level. So nine, so 18 or 36 of these little, these little ones. Um, so these are my main highlight colors that I got. Uh, my main one, which the crazy thing is, I've actually been using my brightening one more than my main one, but I think that's because my color is changing now that summer's ending. So I started with June as my brightening highlight. Then I went to Goddess as my main highlight, and then Indigo as my contour. As the seasons change, my colors are going to change. The cool thing about Saint is it always is perfectly matched to your skin. So even if you like feel like something's a little off by the time you blend it, as long as it's not like a completely way different shade than you are, um, it's going to work out amazing. So I just popped these in here. The cool thing about this, their palettes are magnets. So all of these little tins that are metal just pop right in there and they stick. So you don't have to worry about anything falling out when, you know, if you knock it off, you might have to worry about some of this breaking. So don't knock it off. Like if it's not the cream makeup, if it's your eyeshadows and everything. But anyways, that's really cool. So these are awesome. You can just have all your stuff in your purse in one palette and go. Um, they have smaller ones. They have bigger ones. It just all depends on what you need. I definitely need bigger ones. And you'll see why over the coming days as I do more haul videos. Okay, back to my Saint haul. So I got my brightening highlight, my main highlight, and my contour. Then I also got, these are the illuminators. I don't know if you can see that very well, but I'll put it on my finger so you can see. So that one is um, pearl, super pretty. Then we have honey, which is more of a yellowy, but they just are basically um, highlights. You know, I usually put them here. Sometimes I'll put them here anywhere. I want to kind of catch the light whenever I am, you know, doing something fun. And this one right here is rose gold. I'm doing this on my webcam, so I'm not usually used to it. I'm used to my phone, so it's a little bit weird right now. <laughs> um, this right here is my Vanilla Dust Setting Powder. Now, the cool thing about Saint, you do not have to use a powder. 
but sometimes I like a little bit more of a matte look or if I'm going to be out in the sun all day, I just like to, the, to top it with a powder. So this vanilla dust setting powder is something that you can get if you want, but you don't have to. It's just a like a whitish powder that you put over your makeup to set it if you feel like you need that. Then let's go ahead and go to the eyeshadows. The eyeshadows that I got in my first order are, uh, this is Cupcake. It's like a cream color. So, you know, it's kind of my all, all over my eye and really up here on my brow bone color. Then the next one that I used before I ordered more was Mama. And it's like a, like a pink, a very kind of like a light mauve color. I really like that too. It's great for right here on your lids. <clears throat> and then the final color that I ordered in my first order is pomegranate and it is like a maroon burgundy color. So their eyeshadows are really, really pretty. They have shimmer eyeshadows, matte eyeshadows, cream eyeshadows, and glitter eyeshadows. And oh my God, I just got one of the glitter ones. That'll be coming in another video. Um, so the three regular size lip colors that I got in this order are pink grapefruit, this one's a staple for both my lips and my cheeks. It just gives you a fun little pink glow on your cheeks. So it just looks like you've been out in some sun, getting a little bit of sun. And I'll show you that on my finger. That is pink grapefruit. Then we have carousel, which this is not really a pigmented one. This is more of like a sheer, almost like a gloss. So you're going to see when I put it on my finger, that's it right there. You can see a little bit, but it's definitely not as pigmented as the pink grapefruit, but it's great for just like, if you want to put something over your lips, just to have like a little glossy feeling. So that is carousel. And then the last big lip color that I got is black cherry. Now I know that looks a little intimidating, but I promise it's not. Um, it's a little bit sheer. So let me get this on that finger so you can see it. But when you put it on your lips, it actually is so pretty. Hold on. So it's way much more sheer than it looks in this tin. Like when I looked at it, I was like, that's going to be really dark. And I love a red lipstick or a dark lipstick, but I was a little bit nervous. But no, that one's so pretty on. Then the ones that I did that are the holiday lip and cheek, which just means they're like the eyeshadow size. I did Dahlia. Let me show you that one. If I can find a clean finger, because I didn't think to bring a rag or anything to wipe my fingers on. Dahlia is very pigmented. I don't typically use this on my lips a lot um, just because it's almost too much for my lips, but I do love it on my cheeks. It makes an, another really pretty pink glow, but I just don't like the shade for me personally and my skin tone. It doesn't always look right on my lips by itself. Now I will mix and match it. So that's something you can do if you get a shade that you don't love. Try mixing it and max, matching it with some of the other shades that you get because a lot of times you can find a great combination. Or if you just absolutely get it and you're like, I am never going to wear this, Saint does returns and exchanges. So you're going to be able to either get your money back or exchange it for something you will wear because they want to make sure, you know, their customers are happy and are enjoying the products they get. So then the next color that we have, and I actually just got a bigger version of this, is Nude. And it's just what it says it is. It's it's like a nude color. It's really pretty on. It's great. It goes with pretty much any eyeshadow look that you want to have um, because it's just a good color, a good color that goes with browns and pinks and all the things. So definitely a staple in mine. And then last but not least for all of my color things is Ruby. And she's really pretty. I love a pink lipstick and that one works really really well. So yeah, so now that I'm covered in all the things lip, let me show you the last two items that I got in my first order. One is, this is the powder brush. So what I actually did was the powder collection. So it came with the setting powder and this brush. I like this because before I get all the other brushes that I um, got recently, I use this for applying my contour because it's a little bit thinner on the side. So I could just go here, I could go here, and I could easily go here. And what I loved about this side I actually used my blush brush for, for the powder. I liked this one for blending stuff out. So when I got all of my highlight and contour, especially right here under the eye, this angled one worked so well. So I typically use that to blend out the stuff near my eyes because it just works really well in getting up there, like on the bridge of your nose and all that stuff. So that is the powder brush. It's an angled on that side. Let me show you. Look at me covered in lipstick. And then that side is the little tiny side. 
So, and then the last thing that I got, I don't, oh, it's right here. I'm so sorry. I've got to step out for just a second. Is because apparently I leave things on my bed when I do lives, is the blush and bronzer brush. If you only want to get one brush, this is the one you want. This is great for blending. It's great for your blush. It's great for all the things. So I use this side a ton when I am blending my makeup because it's just, it's super um, like compact. And so it blends everything really well. Um, like I said, I like the other one for getting up to my eyes, but this one goes there too. So I just blend, 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 blend with this side. And this side, sometimes I'll place the blush on my cheeks and blend it out. Sometimes I'll just dab this in my uh, lip and cheek color and then put it on my cheeks with the blush instead of tapping it on my fingers and then blending it. It's all up to you. But if you're only going to get one brush, this is definitely the one to do it. You have your blush side and then you have your bronzer side and or blender side is what I like to call that. So that is it. That is what my first Saint order consisted of. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this Saint haul. If you have any questions about Saint, feel free to come join my Facebook. It's Facebook group. It's time to glow up, but I'm also makeup and margs over on Facebook. And you can email me at glow up at glow up with Tony at gmail.com. If you want to be color matched, if you want to find out about hosting a party, or if you're interested in becoming an artist yourself. But for now, it is time for me to go. And I hope you guys have a great day. It's time to glow up.